Hey everyone, I uh, wanted to show you what's inside of a transponder that I found on the road. Somebody threw this out or it fell out of their window or I don't know what happened. It was tossed out onto the road and it cracked open. This is for a 407, a highway in the area. It's similar to Easy Pass transponders and various other types of highway transponders. You can see the model number there. It's for 407 and it's made by a company called CAPCH, K-A-P-S-H, S-C-H, K-A-P-S-C-H. If you look up their website, you'll notice they have a lot of different transponders for various companies around the world. So open it up, there's the board inside. I'm just gonna show you what's inside of here. Uh, first, we have to remove it from this side. There we go, so I'm doing this with one hand, trying to wiggle this out here. And uh, surprisingly, there we go, okay. Okay, on this side, we have a big battery. It is glued in to the, to the other side of the case here. You can see it's kind of see-through. Um, not rechargeable. This thing is one of those long, lasting, maybe 10 year long last, uh, lasting lithium batteries, okay? Happens to be AA sized, and uh, that's just the format of it, but it is not rechargeable, okay? We'll have a look now at the board. One side is pretty much not, not populated at all. Lots of holes, through holes there. Um, big metal area, could be part of the antenna. We flip it around see that looks like it might be part of an antenna and let's have a look a lot of components on here I could not find much about most of them if we zoom in there is a microchip right here pick 16LF 1937 it's a programmable chip seems to be doing the majority of the work on this thing. And we have some LEDs that light up here when you pass underneath the transponder uh, antenna system. You know, when you ent enter and exit the highway, it picks it up. Um, lots and lots of little tiny um, components here, resistors, capacitors, and so on, all throughout here. I don't know what this big package is here. It says TP124-003-216F16 F one six two. Now it only has two connectors on each side for soldering. I'm not sure what's underneath here. Uh, got a hole. This might just be a, a cover for some kind of RF uh, related circuitry, but I don't know. And then there's one more big chip over here with lots of uh, stuff, Mark IV IVHS, and there's the information there. That's a clock frequency chip there. So that's essentially it. That's your KAPSCH manufacturing date, 1611. So could that be 2016, 11th month? Is it this that old? I don't know, um, but there you have it. If you know anything more about these and uh, feel free to uh, comment on this video, let me know. But just wanted to share with you what's inside one of these transponders. Thanks for watching, bye for now.